so guys i promise to give you any information you need to know about this hair in my previous tutorial but i failed due to poor lightning and the video quality wasn't that good so yeah i decided to chip in with into this video and show you everything that you need to know and i apologize for that so this is the type of braiding hair that i use it's the noble gold and it comes in a package like this So once you open the hair, this is it. So it says noble gold and I got the color one. Yeah, and the style is pink bulk as you can see right here. This pack is so 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 cool guys. It's very cool. Like you know me, you know I like full things. I always like to be economical though. I go in for um not a cheap per se but like i'm going for hairs that like i'm going to have to use five or six packs for my huge head so once you open the package this is how the, the hair comes in the pack it comes in five balls five balls as you can see and out of each ball you get five smaller sections so with here i've got um one Three, four, five. So there you go. Five pieces, and so just say multiply five by this five, which is twenty-five. So with this pack, you get twenty-five of these. Whereas some other packs, they are only these two. So five, five, ten, and with that, you have to get um, four to five of these packs before you can get a full head but with this one i only bought two packs and i didn't finish all i was left with this this one so i used a full pack and four of these which is very 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 good so if you're on the budget side like me you should go in for this hair yes double gold and this hair is so 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 soft and bouncy for the texture of this hair so with this pack all you need to do is cut below the band right here so you take your scissors and cut below the band and with this like one of these i split it into three so with one of these i have three toys so this pack is very very economical and it can be dipped in hot water I don't know if I dip some of my ends in hot water no, not all of it, I just dip, dip some on camera because I was trying to see whether it can be dipped in hot water and it's really curled very very nice so if you want to keep it with it curls at the tip this hair is also pretty good for that um, so as I said, I use two packs. I use um, one, a whole pack for the pre-twisting, for the crocheting, and then I use four of these for um, my frontals and then around my head. And it took me three hours. It took me three hours. I, took, I used one hour to do the crocheting. Excluding the corn roll, I braided the corn roll separately. So, excluding the corn roll, it took me one hour to install the crochet, and I used two hours to braid the corn towel. So, yeah, that will be all for the hair details. Let me know in the comment box if I forgot to mention anything. You can ask me questions in the comment section down below, and I'll make sure to reply to you as well. As I can, I, I really, I don't know. Like I'm always with my phone, so I reply to um, comments really fast. So you can send me your suggestions, comments, anything, anything that you need to know about this hair. And how I maintain this hair is very simple. So every morning I style it the way that I want before I go to work, and I spray the oil sheen. This is the UV Universal Basic Oil Sheen. I spray it on the hair to give it a little bit of shine. So I just spray around it. And I use my fingers to kind of rub. 
spread it everywhere and that gives it a little bit of shine and always this hair looks new so I just lay my edges and I spread it and that's how I maintain it I don't add any other product or do any other stuff so thank you guys for watching and I'll catch you all in my next one bye